Uh, Pete, Jerry and I are preparing for the next balloon launch. Here are photos we took from the last one. Uh, you can see the Severn Estuary. Here's the Isle of Wight. And a photo of the whole of the south of England. Here's the sun reflected in the English Channel and you can see from the wash all the way round to London. Um, for our next trip we want more accurate uh, information so Jerry has put together this GPS chip connected to an Arduino computer. Here's Jerry who's done all the programming of it and um, assembled it. It produces data like this so the challenge is to um, make um, sense of it. Uh, so for our next balloon trip. Here we are um, with Jerry's journey. Uh, first plotting it on a map so we hope to do the same for our balloon and this was Jerry driving on that particular journey and we can animate it. Clearly see him driving around the roundabouts. Of course when we do our balloon, next balloon um, it will we'll be able to plot exactly the altitude and the uh, the journey it makes across the countryside. Here's Jerry driving along the motorway and let's see where he's going to go. You can see how accurate the GPS is, it even shows him on the left hand side. It's not perfect because every now and again uh, Jerry seems to clip the uh, the curb which maybe he did or oh, he's arrived. Uh, let's see if we can see that with another view. So, same view, but this time speeded up again. It's speeded up 25 times. We've added uh, a speedometer, see how fast he's going, and we've got the other map, the um, satellite map. This is Google satellite map. Um, what this means for our next uh, balloon uh, flight, when we go up to 30 or 35 kilometers, we'll know exactly the altitude and we'll be able to plot the altitude and the um, position um, wherever the balloon um, is traveling over the UK. So now you can see Jerry clipping the curb as he drives. We think it's an inaccuracy in the GPS rather than his driving, and here he's parked. So now we're just waiting for our next uh, balloon launch, and here's Jerry, me, and Pete. And uh, we'll post another video with the more accurate data when we next launch.